Phase 2 of the removal of the LaSalle Causeway lift bridge, removal of the counterweight, was completed early this morning. And then attention turned to Phase 3, the removal of the superstructure above the counterweight. And that involved cutting quite a lot of steel. Whilst an excavator continued clearing up the area of the counterweight, onlookers became familiar with an overnight arrival, a substantial tug, radium yellow knife, and a large barge. Clearing the counterweight provided an opportunity to employ the large shear. There was a brief opportunity in the period between phases to take a look at the whole site. The next phase began with a little bit of root clearance to allow an excavator to move onto the very margin of dry land. It became clear very quickly that it was bracing the rack arm on the north side. Preparations to cut the arm away quickly became evident, and it wasn't very long before a team got down to that task. Steel cannot resist the torch for long and little time elapsed before the beam was brought to ground. With some minor adjustments to the suspension points, attention quickly turned to the beam on the south side. Before very long, it too had surrendered to the flame. Attention then turned to the last two links between the bridge deck and the structure surrounding the counterweight. The crew making the final cut clearly treat it with the respect it deserves. There are enormous forces at play, but no steel no matter what its quality, can resist forever. With this disconnection complete, the bridge deck now stands alone. It will be very interesting indeed to see just what lies ahead in the next few days. Thanks for watching, and if you're as curious about the next few days as I am, please stay tuned to this channel.